Look at that. I think I just caught myself a crankbait. Yep, sure did. It's such an old crankbait that the hooks are gone. Maybe I can clean that up. <laughs> That's funny. It's been in there for years. Use the pliers on this one. Somebody's braided line snapped. Uh, I shouldn't be talking to you here. It's a little messy, anyway. Uh, this is a crankbait. Uh, it looks a little different now. I cleaned it up, cleaned all the algae off of it. Couldn't get all of the algae off of it. Some of it's ingrained in the, uh, there were scratches in the paint. Uh, it's got a brand name on there. I can't quite read it. Uh, anyway, decent color. Uh, I caught this in my Spot Park Challenge video on day two, I think. And, uh, well, that video probably hasn't even come out yet. This video will probably come out first, because that video is uh, going to take me a long time to finish. Anyway. Oh, look, it's uh, Cardell. Or Cardelli or something like that. Can't really read it. Anyway, there were some scratches, and the algae that was in those scratches won't come off. But uh, I got it cleaned up pretty well. And uh, the hooks, I guess, rusted off or something, because all that's left are the rings. And well, every time I break break a crankbait or something uh, like this one, the bill and the uh, the ring broke off the front. Can't use it anymore. But I always keep them. Keep them every time. Every time I break one uh, for the hooks, really, or maybe I can repair it. Uh, these this one I'm gonna take the hooks off and put them on this one, and then I'm gonna try to go catch a fish. With it. Last table, I shouldn't throw my tools around like that. It's still open a little bit, but that's it's all right. Anyway, there it is. Um, not quite good as new. It's it's kind of a chartreuse and bluegill color. 
but there you go. Uh, it's a functioning crankbait once again.